Marshal Observer down here to advise you whether there's any violence, whether or not everything's not being handled exactly as it ought to be, that he would welcome it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, and he says he'd be glad to cooperate, he'd give them, send them anywhere they want to go, see anybody they want to see, that he thinks you ought to know what the facts are. He says that these people that are in the state have them scratched it, and that they've got to do something to attract attention. Mm -hmm. Now, here's what he says about this thing in uh, Philadelphia. He said those people were in Meridian. They left Meridian to go to Philadelphia, which is 45 miles away. Before they got to Philadelphia, they were announced missing by the headquarters of this organization in Jackson. And then they showed up in Meridian and were put in jail after that and kept a few hours and turned loose. Now, he says he expects them to turn up at, uh, claiming with bruises and claiming that somebody's whipped him when that he doesn't believe a word of it. And it is peculiar from what he said that uh, they were reported missing except 45 minutes after they left Meridian and before they got to Philadelphia and they served were put in jail in Philadelphia after that. Okay, now here's a problem, Jim. Uh, uh, Hoover just called me one minute ago, uh, or I guess five minutes ago, and told me that they had found the car. It wasn't headed toward Meridian. It was headed a different direction out of the Indian Reservation. Well, there's all kind of Indian reservations between Philadelphia and Meridian. Well, he said it was headed away from Meridian, but an Indian found it, saw it burning yesterday. And he reported to him, and his agents have gone out there, and the car is still burning. And it's so hot they can't get inside of it, and they don't know whether the people are inside of it or not. But it's the same car they were in because it's got the same license number. Well, I know nothing about that. But the government says you can send some Im impartial man down here, and if you get surprised, you'll life. And there is now, now all around me, there's in Rubel, it's one of the headquarters. And there's, there's just nothing. There's no violence. No friction of any kind. Mm -hmm. Okay, much obliged, and uh, uh, you've communicated my wishes to him, so there's no use of my calling him. Yeah, now, what, uh, I'm going to have to call the Justice Department. They, uh, Bobby suggested an agenda of what you were going to talk about, and he won't say it. All right. That's well, good. That's something we can arrange. Yeah, that's good. I haven't seen it, but I, anything anything suits me, and I want to be guided by y'all's suggestions. Right. You and Attorney General. That's fine. Okay. That's fine.